Well, it's not necessarily how I saw myself coming back after two a two month hiatus, but this is real life. have been cooped up in the house what so feels like forever but in theory it's it's been about two or three days <laughs> but a little burst of sunshine came <laughs> runaway child and we wanted what down crippled dad and we wanted to make the most of it so we are out for a brisk bike ride and um, actually going to fill you in on everything that's been going on in the last two or three months that we have been MIA. Um, we took a much needed break, but we came back rejuvenated, refreshed, and ready to go. So I'm going to get the girls to tell you everything that they've been up to in the last three months. So what have we been up to? We had Halloween. What did you go for as Halloween? Oh, what what about what, Stella's not in costume? Oh, wait, that's right. She changed her mind. And what did you go as? Um, I went as Wednesday for the Adams family. Oh, yes. Oh, and who are you? Oh, you look not happy. Well, very much in character. Oh, yikes. Those are cute. Look at the little Those are cute. The panda bear. <laughs> A little bit cute. cute. birds got their colors. It pierced his foot and made him very sick. For days he laid on the ground in pain and his foot swelled up. He was dying. Let's hope not. Why is he dying? He punctured his foot. All got colors. All except the crow. He was standing away from the others. Crow got no colors at all. So that's how the birds got their colors. And as for the dove, he soon got better, thanked the parrot, and was able to fly away. That was a terrible book, and we will never read it again. Not 
well, I thought for a children's book. But hey, all right. Wait, was that blood? Yep. <laughs> It's 8.25. Clearly the day got away on me. I have an excuse. We got invited to my parents for dinner. We went. What started in a quick, simple game of bingo. B5. Oh, do you have B5? Oh. M32. <laughs> went off into a, a game of hide and seek. <laughs> What's that under there? I didn't know Nana's shirts had feet. <laughs> <laughs> and then taco night, so we left the house there at 7.30, rushed home to get the girls ready for bed, and here we are. So I have left off with filling you in up until October, so we're going to really whiz by November, December here. Sam's birthday was celebrated in November. Super low-key, exactly the way he would want. Then, early December, Sophia had a choir performance, her first choir performance, and it was awesome. I have a little clip here to show you. Santa Claus is coming to town. Then we went right into Christmas festivities with the family. Tons of family, tons of friends, cookie exchanges. Oh my goodness, we ate all the things awesome time. Christmas was incredible. The girls got everything they wanted to a degree, I think. They didn't have many things on their list this year, funny enough. I think the older that these girls get, the less they ask for, but the more expensive the things are. <laughs> Sophia asked for a robot named Boxer, which she got, and Stella, who has never owned a Barbie, nor watches Barbie, I don't even know if she knows who Barbie is. She asked for the Barbie dream house, but not any Barbie dream house. The one with the pool. Uh, yeah. He just gave me the pool. <laughs> he just gave you the pool? I just need a blue thing in there. So she still needs to get a Barbie. We just got the Barbie dream house. Our New Year's was super low key. Um, again, we spent it with family. We actually made it till midnight, which was a big feat for us. Three, two, one. <laughs> That's it. You're all cut up now. We left for three months. We're back. You're caught up. Here we are today. We'll see you next week.